Welcome to my channel. Let's have a look at the 10 biggest passenger planes in the world. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of the videos I upload, and stay till the end of the video so that you don't miss any interesting facts. Do you know which passenger aircraft is the newest and largest in the commercial airline sector? The 10 largest commercial aircraft that you should be aware of are in this video. So, let's get started. Number 1. Airbus A380-800 The Airbus A380-800, a French-built passenger aircraft, takes the top rank on our list. It can carry up to 853 passengers in a single class or 644 passengers in a two-tiered class and can travel up to 8,208 nautical miles or 15,200 kilometers. On April 27, 2005, the Type had its first flight, and as of December 2021, 254 aircraft had been produced. However, Airbus declared that the A380-800 will be discontinued in 2021 because of weak sales. Airbus A380-800 had 14 customers in total and 251 firm orders. The primary operator of this aircraft is Emirates, which has 119 A380s in its fleet. Air France has publicly confirmed that the whole A380 fleet will be retired by March 2023. In 2023, Lufthansa plans to reintroduce four A380s, which will be based in Munich. Number 2. Boeing 747-8 The Boeing 747-8 is a passenger airplane manufactured in the United States. It has a maximum capacity of 605 people and a minimum capacity of 467 passengers in a three-class configuration. The aeroplane can go as far as 14,816 kilometers or 8,000 nautical miles. The 747-8 had been first ordered by Lufthansa in 2006, then by Korean Air and Air China. In 2011, the last order for a passenger version of the 747-8 was received for the U.S. President's Air Force One transport plane, which is scheduled to be delivered in 2024. The last 747 was delivered by Boeing in January 2023, marking the end of the flight due to low demand. The Boeing 777X, which is planned to go into service over the next two years, will take the place of the Boeing 747-8. More than 10 airlines have so far ordered a total of 394 777X aircraft, including all Nippon Airways, Qatar, and Lufthansa. Number 3. Boeing 747-400 The Boeing 747-400 is a passenger plane made in the U.S. by Boeing. It can carry 660 individuals in an all-economy cabin, 524 passengers in a two-class configuration, or 416 passengers in a three-class configuration. It can go up to 13,446 kilometers or 7,260 nautical miles. With several structural and technological advancements, the 747-400 was a significant evolution of the 747 series and it made its inaugural flight on April 29, 1988. Due to the enormous effects of the coronavirus pandemic in 2020, numerous airlines, notably British Airways, ended their entire fleets of Boeing 747 aeroplanes. As a result, Lufthansa, which owns eight of the models, is currently the largest operator of the 747-400. Number 4. Boeing 777-300 with a single-class seating capacity of up to 550 people and a normal two-class seating capacity of 451, the Boeing 777-300 is a wide-body passenger aircraft made in the United States. Depending on the model, it can go up to 13,650 kilometers or 7,370 nautical miles. Number 5. Airbus A340-600 the biggest member of the A340 family is the four-engine wide-body Airbus A340-600, which has a maximum passenger capacity of 370. Several airlines across the world have been using it since its introduction in 2002. With a fleet of 12 aircraft as of April 2023, Lufthansa is one of the major users of the A340-600. Number 6. Boeing 777-200. The Boeing 777-200 is a passenger plane manufactured in the United States. It has a single-class capacity of 440 people and a usual two-class capacity of 400 passengers. 
Depending on the model, it can go up to 14,260 kilometers or 7,700 nautical miles. Even though Boeing 777-200 retirements started before the COVID-19 outbreak, certain airlines, like British Airways and Air Canada, still use them. However, Delta Airlines and Singapore Airlines have altogether stopped using them. Number 7. Airbus A330-300 The Airbus A330-300 is a wide-body aircraft that initially entered service on November 2, 1992. Depending on the airline's choice of seat layout, it can fit between 250 and 440 passengers. Turkish Airlines, Air China, China Eastern Airlines, China Southern Airlines, and Cathay Pacific are a few of its significant customers. In 2020, the COVID-19 pandemic led to a significant decrease in passenger traffic and a corresponding increase in air cargo demand and pricing. Airbus announced a new cargo conversion option for the A330, which can carry up to 61 tons of cargo, to satisfy this demand. Number 8. Airbus A350-900 A long-haul passenger aircraft with a range of up to 15,000 kilometers in capacity for 300 to 350 people, the Airbus A350. It rivals the market with the Boeing 787-10 and 777 series as well as the brand new Boeing 777X which consumers may expect in 2025. The largest operator of a 350-900 aircraft is Singapore Airlines. One of the most successful wide-body aircraft ever, the A350 family has 948 certain orders from 54 customers as of February 2023. Some A350s were modified into cargo aircraft during the COVID-19 epidemic to deliver medical supplies and other supplies. Up to 104 tons of cargo may be transported on an A350 freighter. Number 9. Airbus A340-500 A wide-body passenger plane made in France is the Airbus A340-500. The aircraft, which made its first flight in 2002, was built to carry up to 372 passengers in a single-class configuration and 313 passengers in a typical two-class configuration. Singapore Airlines, which used the A340-500 to run the world's longest trip from Singapore to Newark until 2013, and Emirates were the two main operators of the aircraft. There won't be any A340-500s in use by commercial airlines as of April 2023. Azerbaijan Airlines retired the final two of its in 2019. Number 10. Airbus A340-300 A long-distance passenger plane made in France, the Airbus A340-300, made its first flight in 1993. It is capable of carrying 295 passengers in a single-class layout and 267 passengers in a typical two-class configuration. With a fleet of 17 A340s, Lufthansa is the largest A340 operator. Iberia, which had previously used 21 A340s, however, confirmed the type's retirement in June 2020 due to the high price and unsuitability of four-engine aircraft. We are headed to the end of this video. Thank you for being to the end of the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and tell us what you think about this video below in the comment section.